of Park University, and that is Mike Talamantes. And so far, a successful weekend, 3-0 for you guys. So uh, kind of what you were looking for after that uh, tough loss the other night. Yeah, it, you know, it was tough, too, because um, I wasn't able to make the match, and we had a lot of other things going on in the match against William Penn, which, you know, we won't go into. But um, I like the way the guys responded, um, especially last night against Ottawa, Arizona. Um, I mean, they're a great team, fast offense, size was there, um, and, you know, lost the first set, able to come back, you know, got some different guys in, in the lineup, and so just love the way we responded. Great all-around match right now. Got 15 guys in, so, um, yeah, happy where we're at right now. And you know, one great thing about this tournament, because you have four matches in two days, you could try out a lot of those lineups, and with as much depth as you have, how much of benefit is that for you? Oh, I mean, we were looking forward to this tournament just so we can stretch it out because, um, yeah, just playing four in two days is ridiculous. And so um, having that depth is going to show off in this tournament. So, um, yeah, we've been looking forward to it, and a lot, a lot of guys have stepped up, so we're just happy. And one thing I've noticed, you know, I've been doing a lot of these Pirate Invitationals both on the <laughs> men's side and the women's side. This is one of the more stacked tournaments you guys have had. I mean, not just a team like Ottawa, Arizona from last night, the other Ottawa, um, Ottawa, Kansas, receiving votes. They're a good team. Mo Valley in here, you guys nationally ranked as well. I mean, this has got to be a great test for pretty much every team that's in this tournament. Yeah, don't forget about Mount Mercy. They're a really good team. Our conference is, ex I mean, our conference is the toughest in the country, um, I think, hands down. And so, um, yeah, I mean, we're just, it's a great test to see where we're at. And, you know, so far we're doing well, but Ottawa, Kansas is going to be a big matchup next. But, yeah, we're happy with the, we're happy that everyone came in competition's great um you know we haven't had this kind of event in a couple years because of covid so yeah it's a great event. so ottawa arizona last night i mean that's obviously the marquee matchup for you guys this weekend going in against an undefeated team yep like that you know you lose that first set what was kind of the adjustment you guys made not just in a lineup adjustment but was there any sort of uh you know strategic adjustment as well for that uh to get yourself back in and win the next three sets. Well, so we, we, we've been stressing defense. We've been stressing our back row defense. We've been stressing about playing harder um, past the block. And so switching in, Ben Gallo gave us two guys that just go, just go. I mean, they don't care what's going on. They will go for the ball. And so that just changed the energy of the match. And then once we're getting more touches, Lucci and Peter get more chances to run their offense, more opportunities. So that just, I mean, that was the huge switch. So Gallo, Ben, big win, big switch, and big win for us last night with those two. Now we're, we get ready for one more, three down, one more to go. You've got the guys resting right now, probably uh, eating at this point, things <laughs> yeah. like that, uh, knowing knowing these guys. Um, what are you looking for out of this match with Ottawa tonight? Um, you know, we know each other real well. Um, it's, a, it's a healthy rivalry. Um, so we're looking forward to another kind of big emotional match. Um, but we like it. You know, men's volleyball is just getting better and better. And the teams are just, like you said, this tournament's loaded because the play in the NAI is just getting so much better. So we're just looking forward to another big match. We're just hoping that we finish um, the way we've been playing the last two matches and playing great defense and just backing it up with our serving now because our serving has gotten better the last two matches too. That, that it has. You know, I've seen Girau out there. He's not known for his serving. He's been, you know, doing really well with it as well. Yep. So, you know, some of these guys, it's their last run. So um, they're leaving it all out there. So it's fun to watch. All right. Thanks a lot, Coach. I appreciate the time. And uh, go get ready for Ottawa. Oh, we will. Thanks. All right. Good luck. That is Coach Mike Talamantes as his team.